for the scam Santa Claus. When Brian Delaney saw Whitney's Facebook post, this man who also portrays Santa Claus felt compelled to help. I've experienced some loss this year, and over the years we've experienced some pretty severe loss, so I thought we needed to help the kids and the wife out. After conversing with Whitney on Facebook for nearly a month, he purchased all the items she requested. I bought two tricycles, two action figures from the Kong movie, two little uh, dump trucks full of the toddler size Legos, two outfits each with a pair of shoes, uh, a little art easel that stands they could draw on the easel, and some uh, Hot Wheels cars. What would you estimate you spent? I was $392. Dressed as Santa on Christmas Eve, he delivered the toys and clothes to Whitney's house, but the next day, he realized something was wrong. I tried to message her on Christmas Day to see if, if I could get pictures of the kids playing with the toys, and I realized I'd been blocked. Ryan shared his experience on the Tooele County 411 Facebook page. That's when Michelle Sutton realized she fell for the exact same story from Whitney. I went out and bought three toys, two outfits for each of the boys, a pair of shoes for each of the boys, um, totaling about 200 to 250 dollars. We tried to get Whitney's side of the story. We called the number she gave to Brian and Michelle. Sorry we missed your call. Leave us a message. But it went straight to voicemail. We went to Tooele to knock on her door, but no one answered. Both Brian and Michelle are hurt someone would take advantage of their kindness. It really makes me feel terrible because people really are giving and you know, even if you're honest, people are still going to give, give you what you want. Just for the fact that I could have helped two other kids that didn't, I mean, I'm not sure where the stuff's at. I'm not sure if she's, I would have been fine with her. I would have helped her son. I would have helped, I would have gave him, but I wouldn't have bought two of everything. 